Ataku! Alright, we good? We good? How's the audio? It's so dark. Why does it feel dark? Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. Thank you so much for uh, stopping by. Today on the plate we have yet another Otaku box. I think that this is the June edition. So I am running a little bit behind as per usual on these boxes. If you guys are new to the channel or new to the Otaku box, here is a very quick rundown. It is a monthly anime theme subscription box with hentai options if you want it. I do not get them because YouTube, but uh, if you do want that sort of thing, then go right ahead. So yeah, a Taku box, pretty exciting, pretty cool. Uh, if you guys want more information about the box, there will be a URL down in the description, and I think you get like five bucks off your first order if you're interested in that sort of thing. So yeah, check it out if you want. Alrighty, let's pop this bad boy open. No further need for introductions. Okay, oh my God. Well. I'm gonna let you guys see it for the first time. Eh. Looks like a pretty standard otaku box. Uh, let's see here. We have the little product guide here. We'll set that aside because most likely we'll need it. And the very first thing I see, the reason I had kind of that reaction when opening it, was one of these little little memes here. I think we all know what this is, If you, especially if you've been following this channel. I mean, maybe I'm wrong. No, no, I'm right. This is exactly what I think it is. This isn't on the list, so maybe this is an extra that they sent me. Who knows? It's a high school DXD wrist sweatband thing. And a lot of you guys might be saying, oh, that's pretty cool. You know, that's it's hot here where I live. So, you know, it actually works pretty good. And I can test it right now. There we go. It works. But let me show you guys something. I'll be right back. Stay tuned for this big reveal. All right, so I thought I had four of these from past boxes. I, I could only find two other ones. Yeah, anyways, I, I think the point that I'm trying to make is they send these out like crazy. I mean, I am double pumping sweat bands, sweat wristbands on one of my arms already. But I mean, if you guys are sweaty, then yes, you will enjoy this box. All right, I'm gonna take these off because it's very hot and these don't help at all. So cool, we have another high school DXD sweatband. Um, if anybody wants one of those, you let me know. I, I got the hookup apparently. So we're off to a great start. That's a great meme to start on. Normally we save the figure for last, so I'm just gonna set that aside. We'll, we'll come back to the figure. It's not going anywhere, I promise you. Oh my God, what is this? We have a hat. One thing you guys might not know about me is I wear hats about 99% of the time that I'm out in general public. So it is very weird for me to get a hat in one of these boxes. I've never seen that before. No game, no life. Apparently it's a hat from No Game, No Life, but uh, I don't remember them having any reason to wear a hat. I don't think Shiro or Sora would ever play baseball considering the pair are Hikokiyomori. However, I do love wearing clothing from my favorite animes and the No Game, No Life cap is perfect. I hope you like it too. Well, I'm not sure what that says. It would've been nice if they tell me. It probably just says something like, look at this stupid weeb or something, but uh, yeah, I guess we can try it on. I usually don't like my hats this is bent. Oh, it's pretty comfortable though. It's weird that it didn't come in any packaging. Like maybe they just took this off some weeb construction worker's head over in Japan. I'm not sure. Yeah, it, it feels good. It feels like a hat. Cool, so we got a hat. There's a little model for you guys. All right, what else do we have? Uh, so that's the shirt. So we'll save the shirt towards the end of the video as well. Uh, My Hero Academia phone charm, okay. So if you guys like My Hero Academia, you guys will be all over this. Apparently these are very popular in Japan, at least what I just read on this sheet. So I don't like to stereotype, but that's just what I, I heard. But yeah, it's a nice little My Hero Academia phone charm. Um, I'm not really sure how this would work. In Japan, do they still use like flip phones or are they are they on the iPhone game? I don't know. I watch too much anime, they still use flip phones, but I don't know if that's a good indication of what they actually do. Anyways, there it is. Uh, it works. That's really the only place I can put it on an iPhone. Yeah, it kind of covers up my charging port, but that's not a big deal. It's all for looks. It's definitely worth it in the end. Perfect, when I'm taking a phone call, it'll just be 
dangling right in my face, so that'll be pretty cool. All right, what else, what else? This is interesting. I feel like we've seen this before, but we have a Rius die cut sticker from High School DXT. That's pretty cool. We've actually seen this artwork before on a shirt. Um, I don't feel like getting up and walking three feet to get the shirt, so you'll just have to take my word for it. That's actually pretty nice. I do like me a good sticker, and I like Rius, so um, that's a win-win for me. What to stick it on? I would stick it on my display case, but I feel like that looks pretty tacky. You guys should comment down below. What should I put this sticker on? You tell me. Okay, uh, let's see here. I think we're getting towards the end here. We have the poster, this month's winner. Oh, of course, Albedo from Overlord. Who, who didn't see that coming? Not a bad little poster there. Um, yeah, she's, she is interesting. She has a large mouth in a lot of shots. It's, her grin kind of goes from ear to ear very evilly. Oh, I forgot the sticker as well. Oh, cool, Sword Art. Sword Art, my favorite anime. I, I rewatch it every week. But yeah, it's Azuna from uh, uh, Sword Art Online. So that's, that's pretty cool if you're into that sort of thing. We got the shirt now, which I'll throw on just for a quick little model just for you guys. Overlord, Albedo. Yay, I'm hitting my cabinet. Let's not do that. Like I've said before, these shirts are kind of weird because they're like a, a polyester material, which if you guys aren't aware, that's kind of like what a sports jersey would be made out of. They're not your standard cotton tee, but they're nice for like pajama shirts or going to like nice restaurants with your family. And the graphics look nice on them. I mean, alrighty. So we got the poster button shirts. Sticker. Oh, phone charm. That was pretty cool. Got the phone charm. We got the high school DXD wrist sweatband thing. Moving on to the figure, Megarin Luca. What a random character to pick for the figure for the month. That's that's very random. Okay, I mean, maybe she's more popular than I thought. Who knows? All right, I don't have my knife, which doesn't help because this thing is... is... Uh, locked up tight, so we'll have to see what I have in arm's reach here All right, I found a universal type C uh, Wall charger, so maybe this will do it. I I doubt it. It's not very sharp. Oh wow It actually worked. Okay. Well now you guys know if you're ever in a survival situation You could skin a deer with a universal type C wall charger all right, perfect. Dang it. Now I gotta get up and go get that. Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me, let me get it. Oh God, where did it go? Found it. Don't, don't worry guys, I found it. Okay, well, I'm not gonna say anything, you know. What do I know about figures? I, you know, I'm not even that big into figures. Alrighty, so there she is, uh, Luca. The Vulcanoid. She's a little bit thicker than, than Hatsune. All right, well, interesting. I really hadn't thought about her in a while, so that was that was cool. Alrighty, so that is going to be the June Otaku box. And that's a pretty standard Otaku box. You got sticker, you get some sort of button, you get a poster, you get the shirt, you get some sort of miscellaneous item, and a figure. That's, uh, that's how it's been, at least for me, 
over the last uh, six months or so, if not longer. But that is going to do it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate every single one of you. A couple quick announcements here. The, I don't know why I'm playing with the pen. This probably is not a wise decision. A couple quick announcements here. The P.O. Box is still open, so if you guys do want to send me some sort of item or letter or piece of art for the next Weeb unboxing video, then definitely feel free to check it out down in the description. And then the other thing would be my Instagram. So if anyone wants to follow me on Instagram, if you guys want to see more of my collection, you want to talk to me directly, um, that is definitely a good place to do it. So definitely check me out. It's the same exact name on there as it is on here. But other than that, you guys, that is going to do it for this video. And I will catch you all in the next one. Peace.